hey, what's going on, you psycho sluts? It's your boy, the Tufty Jizzball, uh, aka the Tufty Womble. That's my real name. Don't don't judge me, people. People, please don't. Don't uh, judge him. Don't judge me. And I'm here with the, with an unfamiliar voice to some of you Wombles, but also if you're from Benny's channel, I guess it's a voice you hear in every video. Fuck, what am I doing? Hiya. <laughs> I'm here with Benny Bob. You want to just say hello and talk about yourself for a little bit? Um, explain <laughs> your body to them. <laughs> What's up? It's your boy, Benny! Um, I'm here coming at you with the official G unit. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. No. <laughs> Alright, yeah. Okay. Hey, Hilo, how's it going? My name is Benny Baum. I run oh. a gaming channel, much like Tufties, except I do a little bit more of the playthrough genre of things. That's true. Uh, currently, right now, I'm doing a zany, zany Happy Wheel series, but I also have a lot of other series, just like like other things. I, I have quite a few, but I am very bad at keeping them running, but that, that, that's, that's, that's something that's, that's safe That's not the point. That's, shh, shh. No one needs to know until they've gone onto your channel and subscribed and then gone, wait a minute, this guy's a fucking made a video in six months. Yes, <laughs> he's stupid. <laughs> You're a little Stupishy. bigger. All right, we're here. We're here today to uh, liberate your rectums with a new idea that we came up with, and it was literally on the fly. And I, and we're just like, why don't we make a podcast? So, welcome to the first episode of It's Your Boy Podcast. <laughs> it's Your Boy Podcast. <laughs> it's your boy. I'm tempted to add in a laugh track at that point. I might actually do that. So, if you hear a laugh track, <laughs> it's, it's because I've fucking I don't know. I've become Big Bang Theory. Okay, so um, <laughs> we, we've kind of just talked then about who we are back and forth and uh what games we playing this week actually what have you been playing uh, obviously my answer is getting pretty generic <laughs> what have i been playing yeah um <clears throat> well i've been quite busy with the schooling as of late because yeah. they think that it's a good idea to lower grade as much as possible in the last two weeks so lots of projects and stuff but i guess recently the happy wheels I guess the most, Happy which I don't. I'm not really quite the proudest of. But my <laughs> you're such a casual like gamer, faggot. What are you doing? Oh my god, scrub! <laughs> uninstall faggot. Oh my god, you should just get Linux, you scrub. <laughs> um, QQ noob and uninstall. <laughs> scrub a cake. Uh, is that what you've been playing? Just Happy Wheels. What about Trials? Because I know your Trials series is pretty popular. Like I personally love Trial HD. Like that's like I don't even have the game, but I just like watching you play it. <laughs> it's, like... it's such a good game. Yeah, I've been doing Trials, but unfortunately, it's like. 0.14156 frames per second because Fraps is a Fraps, is, a, is a scumbag. Fraps is a so devil. I just recorded. I'm gonna be buying size. um, gonna be buying a uh, the other program that I'm going to be buying, which I can't remember the name of. Dick's and then, then I'll be Dex able to high. continue recording. But for now, it's on hold because I know laggy gameplay is just horrible to watch. Yeah, exactly. It doesn't look so bad. Maybe it's just laggy for you, but I reckon that. It, obviously, when you play it, it must be really laggy because fuck Fraps. Fraps is the devil. I don't know why Fraps anyone... Is Fraps is the, evil. Fraps is evil, but it's kind of the only thing that I use because I'm too lazy to get any other one. Um, <laughs> for me, for me, what I've been playing, it's I've just been League. I'm, I'm, fuck, I'm so addicted. It's awful. I need help. Someone sent help. Um, this is nearly as bad as the time that I tried marijuana and I turned gay. Uh, it's just awful. I'm... <laughs> I'm, 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 I'm in an ultra loss of you my life. You heard it here, folks. Kids, marijuana. It makes you of the homosex. What would your parents think if they found you dead on the floor after smoking weed? <laughs> like, let's, let's be honest here. Um, this is pretty much League, and then a little bit of Counter Strike whenever I get. Oh no, COD Four actually. I'm not Counter Strike. Mostly COD Four, just PC COD Four. Because I'm a PC faggot. Hell, oh, scrub. Take that you little console. <laughs> Me too. Don't uh, worry, it's okay. Double high five. <laughs> All right. Um. <laughs> <laughs> Um, the next part is uh, it's one that I guess people might be interested in if they follow us religiously, like another religion. What we're working on on YouTube, you can go first, because I assume you have a lot more to talk about than I do. <laughs> oh. You do? What we're working on YouTube? <laughs> yeah, what are you working on on YouTube? <laughs> What's your plan? What am I working on? Well, I've been, um, I am um, do a make of for a animating. I do oh, cartoons. Oh, I'm so ready for this. I'm so ready for um, this. So, I'm going to start releasing... Uh, I, I've been where I'm gonna talk about it because Do it. YOLO. Talk um, about it. <laughs> Do it. Uh, so I, I've had this this comic series since like fifth grade that me and my best friend at the time Smith um, we used to make and it's called Zink and the Boss and I <laughs> have like over 100 pages of just different wacky plot lines. Um, so I'm gonna make it webcomic and then I'm gonna start making cartoons. So I'm gonna have series on my channel. Don't oh know my if I'm god. Make a second channel for that, but that's going to be a thing. I cannot wait and for that. And also, also <laughs> I'm, oh, <laughs> I'm making animations for Tufty now. Yeah, that's so. right. I, I actually I actually got him. I came up to him with a knife one day. I saw him just walking down the street and I was like, "Oi, 
I'm gonna get that kid, and I came up to him, and I put a knife up to his throat. And then he slit my Achilles tendon, <laughs> so I yeah. was just like, oh, I broke God. his leg so he couldn't move, and I was like, run now! And so he's in my dungeon, actually. We're, we're using we're using TeamSpeak, but he's actually in my dungeon, uh, tied yeah. up, making animations for me while I whip him repetitively. And he's like, can I have bread and water? I'm like, no. No. The only thing I am allowed to wear is this piece of paper that he found on the floor. <laughs> He's actually in a news. I'm just wrapped up in a newspaper with holes in it so you can animate, and then the rest is just your legs like tied down with chains, and there's like a little tasery kind of fence surrounding your computer and stuff, so you can't like I don't know turn off the computer ever, and it's always on. And I'm wearing a shot color. <laughs> so yeah, that's a thing. I don't now. mind it. You don't know my. You don't mind it at all. I sometimes <laughs> I come down to give you some natural nutrients, if you know what I mean. Wink, wink. Hashtag. Not a rapey quote at all, and um, <laughs> I pretty, I pretty much um, boosted my ego here. So Benny's like, "I'm gonna make you some animations," and I went, "Oh God, I'm turning into him!" And I was like, "Who's him?" PewDiePie. <laughs> and, and then I realized what was going on. But I have, I, I'd so much thank you for this. Like, it's actually crazy. I'm gonna thank you live on It's Your Boy Podcast. That's actually amazing. It's Your Boy Podcast. It's your boy podcast. Yes. Um, no problem. So definitely, friend. definitely, definitely go check out Benny for those. Or oh, especially his webcomic. I'm so excited to see that webcomic. Um, what I'm making? Uh, fuck. Uh, every time. Uh, God. Uh, red fire trucks. All red and. Um, I, I so, I'm pretty bad. So red. So red. I'm pretty bad when it comes to like I don't know structuring. I just make a commentary and whatever. But I do have a series I talked about the Daisy stuff. Daisy series. I recorded like seven hours of that. I'm yet to edit because of school, as Benny has as well. Um, yeah. Just school, really much. I have exams. On you, government. Fuck <laughs> you, trying to give me education. Why can't I just fix aircons and fucking fix roofs for a week? <laughs> That's no me gusta la escuela. La escuela es el diablo. <laughs> we don't have many Mexicans fixing our roofs in Australia. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's not going to work. It's not going to work. <laughs> Completely different racial stereotypes. Um, <laughs> Speaking of racial stereotypes and things that we can talk about, we have story time. Imagine a really oh, you should play that sound effect that you were that we have the the the, the thing the, the the sliding thing. <laughs> Welcome to story time. Story time. Oh, so- <laughs> that's brilliant. That's so good. Um, we've pretty much got a couple of. I have two because Benny's story is absolutely amazing. Do you want to? Who wants to start? Do you want to go first? I think yours is absolutely amazing. Let's do rock paper scissors. That'll work. That right? will work. I'll flip a coin. Ha <laughs> <laughs> Okay, you can go first. You can go first. Okay. All right. All right. I'll start. <clears throat> so my well, story actually happened today. Wait, what? My, <laughs> my story that actually happened today, earlier today, um, in the daytime. You know when day happens uh m- i was over at my friend's house and it was his birthday so he went to the beach and the beach we went to was called venice and it's in the californias and the, the americas and stuff and i can't believe i guess that <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah <laughs> um but anyways so it, it's like half of it is the beach, like with the ocean and the waves and the sand and all that stuff. And then the other half of it is sort of like shops and like people, like performers and things. And it's really nice. And um, so me and my friend, his name is Esteban. We were what a walking. name. What a name. That's and, amazing. Uh, <laughs> That's amazing. We, I, I saw posters of optical illusions on there and he hadn't seen them before. So I was like. Oi, mate, you ever seen those? And he's like, no, mate, I haven't seen those. You know? <laughs> so I was like, well, why don't we go over to check them out? And uh, he was like, okay. And the optical illusion, the one that I was paying attention to and telling him about was like the Jesus one. If you guys have never seen it, it's like a negative image of like Jesus's face because <clears throat> and you stare at it for a long time because if you stare at something for a long time the image burns into your retinas in a negative sense so like when you blink you see it like negative if that makes any sense so like white turns black and black turns white um so when you stare at that and then you blink you see Jesus's face um <laughs> oh my so God. I, we brought him over there and I was gonna tell him how to do it but there are already instructions on there and I was like oh you could just read them but the instructions these, this is where things got really wacky. <laughs> Whoa! Oh. Um, they were really pervy sounding. Like, the original, the, the it started off normal, so it was like, stare at the picture for 30 seconds or more. 
But then it was like, close your eyes, lean (laughs) up and lean back, accept it, take it in, don't resist. And I was like, okay. And then all of a sudden, a wild pedo appears (laughs) and he gets like, like I don't know the 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 the, the metric system because just America use, just is use stupid. the finger thing again where you're like he uses and finger and a toe kind of thing just do that <laughs> yeah okay so like your middle finger he got like okay the size of your hand the distance of your hand right he got about that close to my face like from your wrist to the tips of your fingers and he was like you wanna know why I put these pictures up here and I was like share friend <laughs> and he was like well. It's for the, uh, and, and apologize to my viewers for the language, but I'm just quoting here, so not my words, and it, it, it's for the tits, and I was like, whoa, hey. The tits? It's for the tits. <laughs> I was like, whoa, and I was like, what are you talking about? And he was like, well, for the girlies that come up here, you know, when they lean back and look up, sometimes their shirt falls down so I can just look. That's so funny. So we were like, whoa, this this guy, this dude. Oh my god. He's creepy. So we walked away. That's and that's cool. the story. That's that, I... <laughs> Oh my god. What the fuck? It's just so weird. Just like what did he look like? Just like describe him. Was he like kinda old and seedy? Just... Perfect pedo. Perfect yeah, pedo, like... just like a little little neck beard as well. A little Like, neck... okay, imagine like a potato. Yeah, I get that. But like yeah. dyed skin color <laughs> with like pedophile facial facial features without the glasses and bald and wrinkly. But not old. Oh my but god. fat as well. <laughs> he was like a potato, this is the best way I can describe him. Oh god. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna I have had a, a real he was hard missing time. teeth. You have a feeling you're missing teeth? Oh, from what? From what, Benny? From what? Um, oh, okay. man. I'm going to have a really hard time now trying to top this, but I'm going to try my best. All right. So one of the stories is one that happened a few days ago, and I was with a friend, and the other story is one that's something that I did that I'm ultra ashamed of, but I think I'm going to share with it anyway. <laughs> All right. So the first one, um, a few days ago, I was walking to the toilet, my friend's there, and he's in one of the cubicles, and I'm just walking over to the urinal, and there's this special needs kid uh, who just started at the school. I didn't know anything about him, and or of what he does, but... Then I hear a little voice coming from cubicle one. He's like, uh, excuse me, uh, cubicle two, are you taking a poo or a wee? And it's like, what the shit? And it's just, I'm like looking around and I'm really freaked out because I, I don't know if that's my friend trying to like fuck with me or something and then I just, just turn around. And then, uh, I don't know, this is really quiet. And he's like, uh, the, the cubicle two, uh, that is for pooing, not peeing. Please leave or use the urinal. I'm just like, I'm fucking getting the shit out of here. So my friend leaves. And I'm just kind of sitting there and he's just like, um, uh, excuse me, a urinal. Are you, um, peeing? Would you, do you need to do a poo? And I'm like, I'm like, no, I don't need to do a poo. And he's like, all right. And then I'll let you go. And he flushes like as a way to let me go. <laughs> so weird. He's like, shh. You can go now, and I was like, oh, "Fuck, okay, okay." And I just left, left instantly. And then I saw him again with his finger inside a drink tap, and I thought, "All right, better not make a mental note of that. That drink tap is never going to be used again because you've just spent a good solid hour sitting inside a cubicle." I'm not. He, I heard that he makes um, clay models, but with the feces. <gasps> He goes back and waits for people to finish, and he goes and collects it, then just makes little, like, figures of what their faces were, because he took photos of them from under the cubicle or something, <laughs> and he's just got, just like, keep a... track of them. <laughs> he's got, like, a box full of them. <laughs> Hello, Jacob. He's the walls with it. <laughs> and he's just, like, smears, like, evil signs, like, you can't pee here, but, like, in shit on the wall, so you just, like, look up when peeing, and he's like, you can't pee here. <laughs> it's a mixture of poo and blood. Where does the blood come oh, from? Well, blood. Oh god, I'm just imagining just like the weirdest shit right now. Okay, we're gonna move on here before it gets too weird. Okay, so the next story is something I did when I was like fucking. I was pretty young. I don't know how young. It was about coming on like seven ish. So coming. I don't know. Uh, let's work it out. This here. one's my favorite. This one's Benny's favorite. Um, <laughs> it's yeah, it's about seventy. I was, like, I was pretty young. Let's put it that way. Uh, seventy, seventy, fuck seven. <laughs> and there was we had this cat. She's still alive now. She's pretty grumpy and bitchy. So she's a pretty old cat. And she used to pee all the time in corners. Like she used to pee everywhere. She walk in. She's like, "What you niggas doing? Do 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 do." Shake it, get her booty, and she just pee while she walks. Like she wouldn't care. I'm sorry if using the N word, but she wouldn't care. Like she really wouldn't. And it got kind of ridiculous. And I was sick of coming home every time and just smelling my room 
just have this awful cat pee smell because you've smelled cat pee. I mean, let's be honest here. Everyone's smelled cat pee. You know that smell, Benny? Yeah. That kind of like... Gotta awful. get that young... Uh, what's it called? <laughs> that young... Crap! Can't remember the... Damn you, Presque-Vu! <laughs> <laughs> that like really strong smell. Like he just can't get rid of it. Anyway. Um, yeah. <laughs> I was getting sick of this shit. So in retaliation... I'm a fucking weird dude. In retaliation, she's outside <laughs> one day. She's just, of, she's just doing her business. I, come, I just pull out my pants and I start chasing her while peeing on her. <laughs> So I'm chasing her around the garden, just peeing on my cat, and she's just running. And I'm like, no, you're getting back here. So I'm sprinting around, little six-year-old kid, rolling around with my penis hanging out on the front yard. Everyone can see me, and I'm just trying to pee on my cat. And I just thought, fuck it. What have I done? What the hell have I done? And to this day, I feel ever so bad about it. But at the same time, somewhere deep down, I was like, don't you fucking piss in my corner. And then I think it's payback. She kind of understood that because she went up to my room that very same day after we cleaned her off, and she just pissed and shit right in the corner as in like I was like you are <laughs> you fuck, fuck you you're so dead to me but uh, I love her so much <laughs> that's, that's my weird relationship with my cat I have so much issues someone please call 911 <laughs> moral <laughs> of the story moral of the story um, call 911 fuck because Skrillex will 991. pick up 991 alright so that's our story <laughs> That's our story Call time. Call 911 now <laughs> <laughs> alright before we go on too much and we just start <laughs> Fucking Skrillex, dude. He's the he's he's the best acoustic guitarist I think I've ever heard. Like this. Oh, dude, yeah. This is pretty his good country music. His acoustic and piano album. I, dude. Did you hear? Oh, that was I love so his country. Good. Did really you hear good. his vocal album? That was my favorite, actually. I reckon. Oh yeah, that one. Where it was just good. like. I still a, think that do, his do, orchestral do, do. acoustic. Yeah. Country album is you know the orchestral yeah. acoustic country. Who combines those things? Skrillex. That's who. That's that actually that's so true. Like his ukulele cover of Adele's like um, album that she made. I can't remember which one it was. Um, yes, you could, he could just play every instrument. You know, he can his actually. Ocarina cover of David Bowie's album. <laughs> the triangle cover of the Beatles. <laughs> <laughs> that's what he could do. I reckon he could fucking pull that off. All right, he's just so talented. All right, he's, like, he's like, all right, guys, I got this, and he just gets his Mac out, and then he just breaks his Mac in half. And then just gets it, and then just gets a big triangle and uses his Mac screen as like the triangle, like little stick thing. And he's just like, ting, "Oh my ting. god, drop the triangle!" And he just piffs it at the stage or something like that. It's a fucking <laughs> explosion of music. Well, I mean, what a really, really explosion of music! It'd be like ting, 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 ting. ting. The Star Wars theme song. What am I doing? <laughs> <laughs> okay, this is where the this is where the podcast gets really unstructured, and we we'll just rabble on for like twenty minutes. Okay, right. eighteen hours. Eighteen hours later, uh, and then I said, uh, and then I just prolapse and I probably die. <laughs> so, then you know what I said. <laughs> do you want do you want to do this for the ending part? Hey, any of you kids? Any of you kids want to buy some meth? Uh, okay. Uh, hey, Benny, come uh, here. Let me touch you. Uh, let me touch you. Yeah. Let me touch yeah. you. Let me touch your little bottle. Uh, uh, <laughs> Oh. I'm going to dry Benny Turn around Face the window I don't want you to see the blood ah! <laughs> And on that note I reckon we should end It's your boy podcast With Benny It's your boy With Benny Who's only penetrated Over team speak <laughs> Oh god oh, This is probably One this, of the I feel like your subscribers Are going to just the, All the comments Will just be Who the fuck is Womble Why is he so weird And why the fuck Do you pee on his cat and I don't have headphones and my mom got me from my computer. <laughs> I've been perspirating all weekend and my mom got me some sick roll on, so I'm good to go. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. I hope you guys enjoyed it. It's your boy podcast. Uh, make sure to definitely check out Benny Bomb. I swear to God, if you don't, and I'll find you, and I will stick my fingers so deep inside of you, it's it, it's crazy. Like I will actually. He won't even enter through a hole. I won't even enter through a hole. I'll make my own hole. I don't give a shit. There's other holes for my feet, and my arms, and stuff like that. I'm just going in, going in dry. <laughs> <laughs> he will um, absorb you. I will absorb it. <laughs> my rectum just stretch over people's bodies and just go. <laughs> <laughs> like a little suction cap thing. Um, <laughs> a teacher doesn't understand the question. <laughs> what? <laughs> Just like sucking up the teacher. <laughs> okay, uh, make sure to check out Benny Bob. I look forward to... I'm actually looking so forward to this webcomic. And he's so, so nice of him to making an animation for... Making an anime... Yeah, got it. What? Grammar and shit. Making an animation for me. It's amazing. Oh, um, dude, I'm going to make like a whole series for you. Oh, God, that's so sweet of you. I love you. I already named it Tufty Tunes. So zany, right? So zany! <laughs> oh my god! Um, <laughs> so make sure to check out Betty Bob. Absolutely amazing. 
And, uh, hope you guys enjoyed this thing. Whatever it was. It, uh, it, it's your boy. It's, it's your boy it's podcast. It's your boy podcast. All right, signing out. <laughs> signing out. It's your boy Wings. Boom. That's my outro. You can, you can do one. You can do one. Let's <laughs> <Please> do one. <laughs> I'll just do my normal one. All right, do it. Uh, do it. All right. Do it. <clears throat> Well, I forgot my outro. Whoa, that's oh, wow, that's interesting. That's, that's a pretty good intro you got there, dude. Can I have that? Can I borrow that for like a video oh, dude, one dude, time? Yeah, dude. Dude, I'll lend you my voice box. You can like use it from there. <laughs> Thanks, Benny. Uh, I forgot my outro. Fuck. <laughs> that's, that's, gonna, that's that's my really bad impression. I can't do it. All right, all right we're getting rambling. We're meant to go three minutes ago. Okay, we're going to go. Stop recording. Stop recording. Uh-